Yo, what's going on, guys? It's Jay with Stream Kings. Um, real quick, I wanted to show you guys how to install any media center or APK. Um, one quick, easy way to do it on your Mi Box. So we're going to go ahead. You're going to need ES File Explorer for this. So we're going to go ahead and open ES File Explorer. Um, and it's already had it open. But what you want to do is you want to go down to the plus symbol at the bottom. All right. And then you want your type to be web. So HTTP. And you want to go ahead and put in your URL. So I'm going to use my media center for this. And I'll put a link below in the description. If you want to download our media center, um, you can do that for free. So HTTP colon forward slash forward slash stream kings and again you can use any um, URL or media center that you'd like to use TV sorry about that uh, info Now notice it puts a space in between the dot and the info. So you want to remove that space. And I'm not sure why it does that, but it does that on its own. So dot info, and then for us it's forward slash APKs. All right. And again, you can use whatever URL you want to use. So, all right. So we're going to do that. Hit OK. So for us, in our instance, it's going to take us right here um, to our index of APK. So I'll just go ahead and click on Stream Kings Media Center. And it'll start to download whatever app it is automatically. Now, the time isn't for sure. Um, it was 29 minutes, it looked like. Now it's 21 seconds or so. So it's pretty quick. Um, and it, it does depend on your internet speed. But nonetheless, quickly, we've got the APK. We've downloaded it. And now we're going to go ahead and install it. So we want to open the file. And we want to install it. And then yes, we'll go ahead and install. And that's it. It's, it's that simple. So um, from here, you know, with the Kodi Media Center, you would install like your build or whatever add-ons you wanted to use. Um, for us in particular, we have a build that's already pre-installed. So once you actually download the media center itself, um, which is a 17.6 fork, then it'll prompt you to go ahead and install the, uh, the actual build and, and get everything going. So we'll just give it a couple more seconds, give this a chance to open up. And one thing to think about too is, um, you know, making sure you have the proper URLs, um, keeping notice for things like that, like the little spaces and, and little things that these programs add. Everything's not the same. Downloader's not the same as ES File Loader, even though they do the same thing. Um, you have apps like Droid Admin. You've got apps like uh, FireDL that you can use codes and download. Um, so from there, we're gonna just go ahead and hit Start on the Media Center, um, and we'll just go ahead and hit OK. And it's very simple, guys. It, this way, everything downloads. You don't have to worry about um, installing anything extra. You can just download the, the actual build and uh, use the media center, and everything is, is there that you need. We update this pretty regularly as well. So super, super easy, guys. And really, you know, less than 10 minutes or so, and we've got everything installed. So I'll go ahead and give that a second. And once this is done downloading, everything will uh, we'll be able to close it and open it back up, and then take a run through it. Um, and that's it. It's it's super simple, y'all. Super simple. A lot of people were charging hundreds and hundreds of dollars to install these applications um, and it's, it's just kind of crazy like you can't jump online and do it I always encourage people to do it I know there's some people that don't want to do it um, don't want to take the time to do it they'd rather have somebody else do it which is okay too um, but definitely it's, it's hella easy and we made it real easy with this app 
with the Stream Kings Media Center, you can you can basically just open it and let it do its thing. Um, and then once it's done, you're good. You'll have all the most recent add-ons and all the, the working stuff, watch your movies and TV shows and things like that. Um, and it's all free, so the, everything in the Media Center is free. We do have a premium section for our, our, uh, our live hosting and our guide, but that's not required. It's, it's definitely something that's optional. And I'm, I'm doing this, I, I was going to speed it up, but I want you to see how long that it actually uh, it would take. And, and like I said, it'll vary with your internet. Um, I'm pushing like 150 megabytes per second download speed. Um, but I do have quite a few things running on my internet. So. <clears throat> It looks like right now we're at about five minutes um, from start to finish. So, again, hella easy. Uh, if you if you got a Fire Stick, you can do the same thing with ES File Explorer um, or Downloader. You can type in the same the same URL, the Downloader, and you can get get it going. What I like about it too is if you accidentally um, clear data sometimes we go in and clear the cache and force stop an application um, but if you accidentally clear the data when you go back to open it again it's not a total loss a lot of times if you clear the data you lose everything you got to reinstall the build um, and search for the search for the repo or what's the newest newest repo for that build and uh, really with us you just got to go ahead click start uh, once you get back into it and it'll, it'll install the, the wizard itself and set everything up for you. So, and that's it, guys. So we'll go ahead and go back to the home screen of the uh, of the Mi Box. Okay, we got the, the media center here. Looks like it just opened up. That's it. Not bad. That's a, that's a different one. So we'll let it go ahead and open up. And that's it. All your, every, you're good to go. You got all your movies, all your TV shows, everything installed. Super easy, guys. So you could, uh, I'm going to leave a link in, this, in the description to the actual uh, URL that I use for this. And again, this is just kind of a description to show you how you can download, um, how easily you can download APKs to your Fire Stick. Um, and I used uh, our media center as an example. So. Hopefully this helps somebody. Um, if you have any questions, leave us some comments below. And, and always, you can reach out to us, streamkings.net. Um, you can find us on Facebook under Stream Kings as well. Appreciate your time, guys.